like to ask my husband to come forward. Bring the Word of God to you. And the Word of God builds us up and gives us God's inheritance, the Bible says. And there's an inheritance to get. And you can only get it through the Word of God. Hallelujah. So listen closely as he brings forth the Word today. God bless you. I'd like to introduce to you Brother Kenneth Gross. All right. All right. Praise the Lord. Good to be here this morning. Praise God. Thank you, Brenda. Well, we just we thank God today for everything that He's doing in our lives. Thank God for our viewers today, our listeners. Lord bless you. And we just give God praise for the blessings of God in your life today. Amen. We appreciate the word of the Lord this morning. I'm not going to take long, just a thing or two. And uh, I may turn it back over to my wife here. But uh, we want to say to you that God is a good God today. He loves you, cares about you. And he wants, he wants you blessed. Praise God. What a mighty God he is. And the Lord, as Brenda was saying, Jesus died that we may be saved, that we may be forgiven, that we can have a life of blessing, and have a life worth living. Praise God. And know our Father. Know the real God of heaven. And have a relationship with him. Praise God. But now we're going to have to believe the word. We're going to have to believe the Bible. And when we say the word, we mean God's word. We'll have to believe what he said. We realize that we're not going to be able to receive anything from God unless we believe what he said. I don't know of, I don't know of one thing that we can receive from God if we don't believe in what he said first. So... Thank God it stems from there, and we began to believe God, and we began to develop a life of faith in Him. Faith in Him. Faith in what He says. If He says He'll do something, then He'll do it. If He promises something in His Word, then He will do it. He means just exactly what He says. Down through time, people have said things about the faith message and this and that. There is no such thing as a faith message. There's just the Word of God. And if we believe it or if we don't. Amen. The devil's clever in his doings, but God's much more clever. <laughs> God always has the answer. Amen. The devil wants to do all kinds of stuff and I'll have to give him credit. He's pretty good at what he does, but he's not good enough. He's, going to fa he's falling short and every, everywhere when the truth shows up. Now, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life, and no man cometh to the Father but by me. He is the way, as Brenda was saying. He is the truth. And we'll do well today to believe in what Jesus said. And we'll do well today to... to as Jesus said himself, he that heareth these sayings of mine and doeth them. He that heareth these sayings of mine and doeth them. Now, we could talk about a whole lot of stuff this morning, but I'm not, I'm not going to go into much this morning. But, he that heareth these sayings of mine and doeth them. It's a doing. It's not just hearing. Hearing is not doing. Doing is not hearing. But a lot of times people hear and hear and hear and they never act on God's word. They never act on it. And I, I want to encourage you today to believe God about something. If, if you're not trusting God or believing God about something, then, then find something that you want from God and start believing him for it. Start exercising your faith. Find something that God said about it. Put your faith in that and start believing him and start 
start believing God to receive something. God never meant for us to just go around and have a bunch of information all the time, just information with no revelation and with no action and with no doing. Amen. Right? Right? There's something going on? Amen. But uh, uh, we want to be able to do the Word of God. Amen. So hearing, it says faith comes by hearing, hearing by the Word of God. So that's the way faith is going to come to us. Faith comes by hearing, hearing what God said about it. But the doing part, it says faith without works is dead. So you can believe something on and on. But if you don't act on the word, then more than likely you'll never have it. 